There is a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart will show me Somewhere in the great unknown When I return from the afterglow Will you carry me like I am? Take you back to my youth and show you what I wish I knew. My will is strong. Look at these birdies, they were so cute. I just loved it so much. Look at them. <laughs> I don't want to disturb it, but I guess one of them already disturbed by me. So, you see us walking to underground train, they call it Subte. It's a very good way to travel in Buenos Aires. So, we currently live in Palermo and we decided to go to San Telmo, which uh, is an hour away with train you switch two different trains and it is very very affordable and so easy to figure out where you go and in this train station i just loved these tiles they need some restoration obviously but they were very very cool very very good i guess one pass is like 12 cents to 30 cents it depends which transportation you take or where you go it is it is very very affordable um so here we are waiting for our soup te our train and it's here already andrew is secretly recording me i'm kind of like tied in there <laughs> We are finally in San Telmo. This is kind of the way you enter. They have a lot of small buildings and kind of you see a few high-rise apartments as well. When we arrived in San Telmo, we went to a coffee shop because we were so thirsty, first of all, and it was so hot. It was like closer to 90s in Fahrenheit, and which is like 30 degrees Celsius. It is quite hot, especially if you're going to walk around. I got some double espresso and this gluten-free, lactose-free cookie and I just love this coffee shop. The year coffee was quite good, it was so so delicious. I am a coffee drinker and I personally am very picky about what coffee I drink and this was very delicious. Do you see these buildings? It's smaller but it's so European as well. It, it is it is just so cute so we are in San Telmo Fair this place called San Telmo Fair it has a lot of small stores like restaurants antique shops uh, San Telmo is very famous with their antique shops you're not gonna believe the number of shops they have and they all are kind of little boutique museums seriously I wasn't able to walk around and record at the same time because the way they put all the stuff together you know, since they are all fragile, I didn't want to hit something and break it while I'm turning or trying to record my bag, my, you know, bottle of water. It was a little difficult, so I decided not to do this so much. Thankfully, Andrew was recording me a little bit, uh, but I wasn't able to talk and record at the same time. So this store was one of my favorite. They have this mid-century furniture and quite modern oh my god it, it was it was something else i just wanted to buy every piece in that mm. store and put it into my house but we can't the shipping is gonna cost way more than the furniture because they are affordable definitely but i don't know how am i gonna bring it back to the us so we decided just to watch just to look at it and come back um we did we did a lot of walking we did something like twenty thousand steps uh, it was good, but it's, it was definitely hot. So we decided to give some break for some food because we were hungry enough and thirsty enough. We got some wine and I got some salad. The salad was delicious. 
And this is a clip that Andrew got it for me because he thinks that I'm an olive monster. I eat a lot of olives, it's a lot for him, but I just love it. This was like a very interesting place to be. They, they are actually some studios and stores, but they open only on weekends. So we were not able to get into the stores, but we just love the layout of the place. It's, it was in, you know, it's in an old shape, a little bit rough shape, but it is definitely unique. I'm sure everybody will love it. Here you see us, we are watching this tango show. Um, it, it was beautiful, but to be honest, um, it was interesting to see this um, homeless guy in there laying down. I think he's maybe high a little bit, I'm not sure. It was very really interesting to see something like while people are watching the stands and he's just there, look, looks like he needs some help or I'm not, I'm not sure. So I couldn't understand what to do. Um, I kind of like mix the clips in here. You see, we go back and forth into the same places again and again. I didn't want to just um, have the same place and then go to the next place. I kind of mixed and match. Hope, I hope you like them. I wasn't sure did I like that. Why not? not? <laughs> we are in a super station again and we're going back home. It is all for this week. I hope you like it. Uh, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel or give it a like. Um, I love you so much and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.